وقد عجز الطبيب فدا الحمد لله مجيب من دعا وفاتح الباب لعبد قرا اذ قوله امن يجيب مضطر اذا دعا اللهم ارنا الحق حقا وارزقنا اتباعه وارنا الباطل باطلا وارزقنا اجتنابه اما بعد if you've called and called and called upon allah and you don't see respond this is one of the tests that you should be patient as calling upon allah needs to happen frequently allah is testing you not to answering your dua or so you need to be patient calling upon allah is the foundation of everything foundation of a muslim a muslim needs to be engaged in this every day every minute you call upon allah rabbul izza as we need allah more than allah needs us because the mighty the king of kings he's there for us muslims we call upon him we need his help we need everything from him he's the king he's the dominion he gives everything to everyone who asks allah says in the quran amman yujibu mutarrun idha da'a wa yakshifu su' who is there to answer the dua of the one who is distressed or depressed and to remove the evil from him it is allah rabbul izza This ayah is one of the great ayahs. I love this ayah so much because this gives me sec- security that Allah is the one who removes the evil when you call upon him. But a lot of people have failed. A lot of people complain to people. There's nothing wrong to tell somebody that you've got a problem, but you need to go to the source, the source of strength. and that is allah rabbul izza allah says in the quran wa idha sa'alaka ibadi fa inni qareeb ujibu da'wata da'ida when my slave ask tell him i'm closer closer to what closer to answer his dua allah needs to be called oh you who's got calamities who's got a problem though you who's facing marriage problem oh you who's facing jinni problem or you is facing magic problem or you is facing children problem or you is facing neighbors problem or you is facing court problem allah needs to be called allah says in the quran again a'udhu billahi minash shaitan rajim bismillahir rahmanir rahim innani ma'akum asma'u wa ara i am with you i hear and i see that is allah rabbul izza Allah says again in the Quran qul id'u Allah aw id'u Rahman call upon Allah call upon the one who is most merciful so calling upon Allah should be frequently or you who've got a problem out there whether you have a problem or you don't have a problem you have to call upon Allah to make you steadfast and hold tight to your religion because there's no blessing like Islam So whether you have a problem or you don't have a problem calling upon Allah it needs to be established frequently and one of the most beautiful thing is Allah is a king king of all kings you will never find a single king around the world saying oh you come here if you need if you have a problem I'll help you no you will never find but the king of kings you'll find him descend in the lowest heaven every night and say who is there to beg so i may give him who is there to seek forgiveness so i may forgive him who is there to ask this is the king of kings coming down every night in the lower heaven and saying this you need if you are in trouble you need to establish the connection between you and allah rabbul izza for your calamity to go away because me personally i deal with a lot of people who've got calamities but these people have some i explain to them they understand some will never understand they are always in their captive 
the shaitan has put them in the captive but you cannot come out from this captivity without you having what allah rabbul izza he says amman yujibu muttarun idha da'a wa yakshif as-su who is there to help or to who who is there to who is there to answer the call of the one who is desperate to remove his evil the evil that is dis- worrying and disturbing him it is allah rabbul izza allah has rights you need to keep his rights or you with two ears his rights you need to keep his rights for you for your duas to be answered you need to stay in the boundary of the islam stay away from haram stay away from haram income your haram stay away from haram in your income should not be haram your dress should not be haram every your food should not be haram you will see your duas being answered but you should not say i don't pray or i pray morning evening and then i call upon allah no you need to call upon allah frequently and you need to be praying five times no you need to be praying five times and then call upon allah frequently and you will see the fruit of it because calling upon allah, allah it brings fruits these fruits are so sweet the only one who calls upon allah knows how sweet is this fruit this fruit cannot be bought anywhere else no it is only when you call upon the king of kings you will attain this fruit the sweetness of this fruit wa akhiru da'wana wa salamun ala al mursalin walhamdulillahi rabbil alamin